This is the 29th of January, 2015. We're at Vincent Corporation. Uh, we've been running a variety of samples. We just went, finished some swarf metal shavings, fine metal sponge shavings, uh, with some degree of success. Knocked out uh, uh, more than one kilo of liquid for every two kilos we put in. Uh, next, we're going to run the um, filter media from some uh, oil filters. Uh, given that this is a small press, about two inches uh, in diameter on the shaft, four inch diameter, uh, larger pieces like this and uh, these gaskets that we found in there would get stuck in a press this small. So we're going to hand sort them. Uh, they could be screened out if it turned out to be an application for such a small press or in a bigger press, a six inch press, they'd go through. What you see coming out right now is uh, actually foam, styrofoam, we put in as a marker to let us know when the press is uh, emptied out. Go ahead and start feeding some stuff in. Now try to sort out the, the stuff that'll yeah. get stuck in there, Bill. We may have to poke this stuff to make it go through. It's the hopper's eight inches wide and only four inches down at the bottom, so it has a natural tendency to bridge. As soon as we get some stuff flowing out of here, we'll close this door. We do that with the air cylinder, which uh, we've got a regulator up here for controlling that. Can leave it at 45? Uh, yeah, we can leave it at 45 PSI. Uh, we're running uh, 60 hertz to get the most torque. We think this could be a high torque application. We would slow the press down for higher juice yield or liquid separation. Uh, but uh, to avoid jamming, uh, we're running at 60 hertz, 20 RPM. Air pressure is fairly high at 45 PSI. Okay, it, we're starting to get some oil out. This is what it's supposed to do. Um, Whatever was stuck in there seems to be moving towards the discharge. We're still not getting any cake out. The yeah, oil that's coming out is actually some cake right here, Bob. Okay. Yeah, yeah we're starting to get some now. Okay. Yeah, there it goes right there. There's still styrofoam coming out. That's their product. Okay. Cone goes in. Now we're going to try and make some press cake. <laughs> Okay, we've uh, reduced the air pressure to one bar, 15 PSI. It brought the amps way down, three or so. Uh, but you can see how white this material is coming out. We're squeezing the oil out of that filter medium. If I grab a sample um, and try squeezing it, I can barely uh, you know, wet my hand. I wouldn't squeeze any oil out of that. Um, so the additional pressure is causing abrasion inside the machine. So we're getting a pretty good oil separation and um, making a nice cake. We are hand sorting all the uh, trash out. Uh, that is the big pieces that would get caught in the uh, four-inch press. They could get caught through the double bridge. Dang, Bob, I meant to have a bucket under there. Oh. <laughs> okay. Oh, we made a mess. Yeah, we made a little bit of oil in mess here. We just opened the cone so we're uh, clearing out the machine. And the pilot area where we're standing here, um, there's a shredder. Mostly there are screw presses around here. One, two, three, four, five. Um, lots of screw presses. These screw presses, and you can see we've got every imaginable size. There's an explosion for vapor type in the back there. Screw presses, rotary drum screen, uh, and 200 machines in the rental fleet. Here's where we manufacture screws down there in the screw department, um, and uh, assemblies down further in the machine shop further down. Anyway, that's a snapshot of Vincent Corporation. Just to wind up this video, this is uh, weighs out to one millionth of a kilo, very accurate scale. There are samples that we took out this morning that had been driving during. Uh, when I see something like that, it was probably press liquor. Uh, this one was that uh, kelp. 
shrimp stuff, a uh, vanilla bean, and no telling. Oh, that was the cassava uh, in the oven right now. Oh, they're all in the back. I've got some manure from a rotary digester. And um, now we're going to run all these other samples. Well, we don't have much we can run, but uh, we've got a few today that will be run.